Hey, what's happening guys? Demon is here and in this video we're going to take a look at the eSteam app on the Hive blockchain. It's possibly the easiest way to get started on Hive as you can sign up, you can comment, you can post, you can upvote and give people those wonderful Hive tokens. You can delegate, you can power down, you can even promote and advertise your post guys. Alright guys? So I recommend this app especially if you're just starting out on Hive. I use this app every day to comment, to upvote, and sometimes to make posts, guys. So let's check out the East Team app. All right, guys, so the first app I think you should download once you join Hive is East Team. Or even if you haven't joined Hive yet, this is the easiest way to sign up through this app called East Team. So it's basically a mobile browser, mobile app for the Hive blockchain. So let's take a look, guys. I already have East Team installed on my phone, iOS. So let's see. Wagwan. So yeah, East Team. Mm -hmm. All right, nice little graphics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My pin code. So let's take a look, guys. So first thing when we go to East Team, guys. When you log in, this is basically what it will look like, right? So you can input your username, input your username here and input your posting key or active key, you know, I recommend. You can also log in with Hive Signer, which is more secure, but if you don't understand all that stuff, guys, just sign in regularly. And if you don't have a con guys just click join now guys up the top here and it will take you to a sign up page pick a username enter your email address and if someone referred referred you you know if i referred you right now just put d millis d m i l l i z i'll probably get some e steam points now this application has its own points guys so very easy way to sign up for the hive blockchain is using the e steam app so download it now, iOS, Google. Jump back in. So let's see now, where am I? Back to East Team. I don't want to sign up. Did my phone froze. Oh, my phone froze. I need a new phone, guys. East Team. So back here again guys, here we go. Another cool thing about eSteam guys, you can add multiple accounts guys. So if I want to add an account here, I can put the info, you know, the username, the posting key or active key guys, depending on what you want to do, right? Or I can use again, Hive Signer, which is actually safer. But if you don't understand that guys, don't worry. You just click Hive Signer down the bottom here, bottom right. And you just enter your posting keys. Let's let's take a look at that. So you just click the app e steam is requesting access to view your current account username. So you press continue. Enter username, you know, password or private key. Guys, I suggest do not use your password, use your private key. You know, keep account on this device, get started very simple stuff guys just follow those instructions right so you have those two choices yeah cancel all right so the cool thing about this guys i can toggle between different accounts if i have 10 3 15 accounts i can toggle between all of them guys so that's very cool but i'm gonna use my main account right here d millis all right no, I'm not logged in yet. The email is all right. So now I'm in my account, guys. So another thing, guys, um, might sound a bit complicated, but I can change the node. So if I want, guys, I can change to another node, another server for the Hive blockchain, basically, right? Okay, so I can't change that now. I can change between English you know USD or whatever I can change not to have pin you can get dark mode and you can set the notifications like if you want push notifications for a new follower votes comments a mention a reblog transfer 
he can set all those guys because if you set for upvotes you're probably getting notifications like a lot so this is the feed that i'm following guys here feed i can see the people i can vote top so these are the top posts on the hive blockchain at the moment or might be on e-steam at the moment ama with turkish hobio telegram my questions and answers yes yeah, so that's the top post these are hot posts on the Hive blockchain right now. You can see what's hot. And here we can see the new post. Pretty cool. And here we can check if you want photos or no photos on our feed. Down the bottom guys. That's the feed again guys. Here is notifications. I can see what's going on. So Nivek Pro voted 100%, very good. In the middle here guys, if I wanna create a post, I can create it here on, on eSteam. And if I create a post like, let's see, post test, I can save the post guys. So that's pretty cool. You can save it and basically come back to it later. That's cool. And then you press the eye icon, you can preview it. All right. Here I can add the tags down the bottom if you want to get bold, italic, you want to put in like um not a chart, but you want to put like a what you call it rows and columns. You can add links, add pictures, and then you just click publish up here, right? Very cool guys, very cool and easy to use. Lead board, what's the lead board? Let's see. So the lead board at the top users you know daily weekly monthly if i go back to notifications i can check replies da, 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 da. people reply to me all right i can check mentions people who mentioned me very easy stuff all right and then next guys we have the wallet so this is where the magic happens guys yeah as they say so in the wallet guys of eSteam, you will see that all right you have E steam points so I'm gonna claim my points so what can you do with e steam points guys well you can trade them on the open market you can also promote or boost your post yeah but let's go into that another time invite friends and earn e steam guys okay so you can invite your friends and you can earn these points the e steam points so that's the reward token of the e steam app but there's also hive tokens that you'll be earning you know on the hive blockchain so e steam is built on the hive blockchain all right um delegations earn e steam every day for delegation post you can earn points by posting regularly posting gives you up to 15 points comments each comment you make helps you to grow your audience and also earns you five points so a lot of instructions are here guys you vote by voting you give reward to other creators and also earn a boat you know you earn some points right so the estimated value of these eSteam tokens is you know 60 let's call it 61 cent here yeah? now I can also check my hive balance here guys so I have zero liquid hive Hive savings have zero as well. So Hive saving guys is basically you can lock your Hive for three days and you can't touch it. Hive is liquid Hive. And then I have 38.842 HBD Hive back dollars. So Hive back dollars guys is one HBD equal one USD. Usually, sometimes it might be more or less depending on market conditions, all right? The estimated value of this HBD Hive back dollars is 36.74. Yeah, and then here, guys, you can see your Hive power. So, my Hive power now is 7,153, right? And delegation, so I've delegated out 3,067 Hive. Okay, so I've delegated that out. The estimated account value is 3,390, right? My vote value is, call it five cent. All right, so that's what's in your wallet, guys. And from here, guys, I can also delegate. I can delegate or power down. So delegate means, guys, I can 
use the tokens staked in my account froze and I can lend them to someone and they have the voting power okay power down means I can turn my staked or my frozen hive into liquid hive and I can send it to someone I can sell it it's liquid powered up hive is staked you can't transfer it but you can delegate it out to someone else and they can use your power and you can take it back anytime guys sounds complicated but it's very simple guys and it's a very useful tool that many many cryptocurrencies are adopting now and steam was one of the first if not the first guys yeah so that's hive power and delegation guys all right if you want me to go more into detail about delegation and hive power let me know but if you read the wallet in peak d which i'll show you in another video you will see good instructions about delegation and hive power yeah now if i go here guys this is my blog post guys so i can see the post that i have created and the post that i have re-blogged right so these are all on my feed on my blog right i can check my replies so very cool guys so that is e-steam app in a nutshell one more thing guys you can also bookmark you can bookmark posts so let's see you can copy the link you can reblog you can reply you can share add to bookmarks promote boost so let's take a look at promote and boost guys so let's show you how to promote or boost a post on e-steam guys very simple click the three dots and then we go down to promote so then I need to enter my pin so you guys you set your pin when you enter your words yeah so then now guys here I can choose how long I want to promote this post for one day or two days or 14 days so the more days the more it costs guys so I'm gonna use this at um hmm, let's promote for one day so you can see I have 307.67 East team left all right approach next confirm and then because I signed in with hive signer for this account then I have to go through this hive signing method if I use the other method um, that eSteam has then my password will be encrypted on the phone and I wouldn't have to do this if I use my active key if that makes sense but if you use hive signer you have to confirm the action guys so let's see put your username Oh, so that's the password field. Put your username, the email is. Put your username, guys, not my username, okay? And then paste. Boom, get started. Approve. So the Hive sign away is a bit more complicated guys so if you're just starting out i suggest you just use the normal way of logging into e-steam which i showed you at the start of the video and that way when you are confirming your promotion or your boost you wouldn't have to do this all right so i think my post is promoted your let's see is it promoted So this post should be promoted now all right and boost works the same way guys but with boost um basically you are trading your e-steam points for upvotes from the e-steam account but one thing about this guys so if i want if i use all my points i could earn up to a dollar and you know 50 cents in upvotes from the e-steam account but there's one catch you have to make the post from eSteam to use the boost feature. If I made a post on another interface, I wouldn't be able to use it to boost that post. The post has to be made from eSteam. All right. So I hope that helps you guys. Let's just take a look at the last thing, guys. Bookmarks. 
so once you add something to your bookmark add to bookmark how do I see that I go to bookmarks and then I can check all the bookmarks I have you know favorites you know all right guys and that's how to use eSteam in a nutshell guys next I'll be telling you about more applications you can use to get started easily on the Hive blockchain guys bless up and yo keep on hiving guys